It's Ash from Super Videos back for another video for Fear the Walking Dead. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at some speculations and theories about Dwight's fate in this next episode of Fear the Walking Dead, Season 8, Episode 9, the possibility of him getting shot and possibly dying in this episode by an ex-savior, which is super interesting to think about because obviously Negan had to face his past in his own way on Dead City and it looks like maybe Dwight will go through a similar situation. We know that Dwight and Sherry are going to go back to Virginia and they're going to go back to the sanctuary and that's possibly where they run into some old members of the Saviors. So we're going to talk about whether Dwight or Sherry or both of them will get killed or not in this next episode and we're going to go through everything that we've seen in the teasers and trailers so far when it comes to things that are related to Dwight and Sherry. So stay tuned, we'll be right back to break this down. Alright, as always, before we dive into it, smash the like button, subscribe to join our community and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. Let's talk about why Dwight and Sherry go back to Virginia. One possible reason could be to bring in reinforcement as much as they can for an upcoming battle with the people that are trying to take over Padre. There is a part in the trailer where Sherry actually says there is a war coming. So obviously they're preparing for some sort of battle, some sort of war. And I feel like Dwight and Sherry are going to look to the first place that they can think of to bring in reinforcement. And that is Virginia. Now I don't know whether they want to go back to Alexandria right away. That wouldn't really make a lot of sense. But based on what they know, the sanctuary is still standing. There are people running it with Daryl there and everything. Of course, they don't know what happened in these years that they were gone. But as far as they're concerned, Alexandria is around. Hilltop is around. Kingdom is around. And of course, the sanctuary is around. So they're going to try to go back at least to the sanctuary first and foremost to see if they can find any allies in this upcoming battle with people trying to take over Padre. We know that the person that's going to accompany them is June. Dwight, Sherry, and June go to Virginia. In fact, one of the first places that they probably visit is Dwight and Sherry's original home, which was featured on the main show as well. Now, I don't necessarily know why they might want to go back there unless there's some sort of nostalgia for them or there's something there as far as supplies that they want to get. But we know that they do go to the sanctuary. We've seen the two of them in the sanctuary and they are seeing the ruins of the sanctuary. So at this point, they know the sanctuary is no longer standing. It's overrun, it's burnt down, and it's no longer habitable. There's other shots in the latest teaser which could possibly show what went down like a flashback. But at the same time, this could be the current timeline and it could just show us Dwight and Sherry there but we know that there's going to be a massive horde there and the three of them are going to run into a few survivors. Now, we don't know if these are ex-saviors, but I mean, it would make sense that there are some, not saying that all of them will be saviors, but there are some ex-saviors among these group of people that they run into. Obviously, we know this is also at the sanctuary because the walkers that Eugene helped build are all over the place like the one we see on the right but we do see someone here pointing the gun at Sherry obviously he's at the front of everyone else so it looks like he's in charge I don't know if he's the leader but he's in charge and we do see Sherry here talking to someone on the radio and pointing a gun back at the guy and obviously she looks back because the fence behind appears to be falling. So that leads to her going towards the fence, trying to hold it in place. And obviously that leads to the fence falling on her and she has to kill the walkers that are there. So that's pretty much how that kind of comes together. And of course, she's going to try to reach out to the radio that she was holding the walkie-talkie 
And I'm assuming that the people that were there are the people that we see behind. And they're just waiting for her to get bit or something like that. But we also see another shot that's in the trailer, which is interesting, which shows Dwight hiding. And then he comes out, points a gun to someone's head and says, how did you know I was here? Or who told you I was here? Or something to that effect. Now, we don't know who this is. It's not the same person because the other guy was bald, but this guy has hair. But it could be a member from that group that we saw. Or it could be someone completely different, someone related to people at Padre or something. But the fact that he says, who told you I was here, leads me to think that this is possibly also related to something with Dwight and Sherry's past, something with the saviors. But we do also know, like I said, that there are obviously a lot of walkers that have the metal on their head, the ones that Eugene helped build. And we do see June killing some of these walkers. So of course we know that June goes to the sanctuary with Dwight and Sherry. So it looks like there's going to be a lot of action and it looks like Dwight is going to have to face some demons from his past. Now, let's talk a little bit about something that's pointing people to thinking that Dwight is going to die. We do see Dwight passing out and falling to the ground right here. And I think this is either at his old house or at the sanctuary. More likely at his old house because of the welcome mat that's on the floor. But what happens to him? Why does he pass out and fall down. We do see another shot that's in the trailer which shows us someone being shot or bit. I think they're shot and I think this is Dwight. So Dwight gets shot and is injured. Does that mean that he's gonna die? I don't think so. Why do I say that? Because it looks like we are gonna see Dwight and Sherry back to deal with the Troy situation. And of course, unless they're playing around with the timeline, Dwight and Sherry weren't there when Troy first showed up. So it means that they come after. But we are definitely going to see them leave to go to Virginia. I think this is before they leave to go to Virginia. But of course, we do know that they are going to be back in time to deal with the horde of walkers that are heading towards Padre because we do see Dwight there when that happens. And of course, we do know that, like I said, they are back by the time Troy comes back and by the time that they have to deal with Troy because there's this shot right here which shows us Troy, Luciana, and everybody. And of course, on the left, we do see June, Dwight, and Sherry, which means that they come back, meaning that Dwight is unlikely gonna die on the journey to Virginia. He might die after the fact, dealing with the Troy situation, but not before that. It looks like he's definitely going to survive at least this next episode for the most part. And where he might end up getting killed is the battle with the people trying to take over Padre and possibly the battle with Troy's group. But we definitely know that something goes down when he goes to Virginia. There's something that he has to deal with because there's a shot like we see here. Sherry walks in to some building. I think this is at Sanctuary. And then Dwight is going crazy, banging his head on the wall and everything. So it looks like he has to deal with something from his past. He has to deal with his old demons and stuff like that. So something definitely goes down with Dwight in this next episode. And it looks like there's going to be some flashbacks or some connections with the Sanctuary and everything. But I don't think that at the end of the day, Dwight or Sherry end up dying before they come back. I think they go to Virginia, do what they need to do, and then they come back. And then there's a possibility of them dying. I don't think that either of them are going to die in Virginia. And I think that the majority of the next episode is the two of them in Virginia. But that's pretty much everything I wanted to go through in this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe to join our community, and press the bell to be notified when I upload on the channel. That's it for this video. See you next time for another super video.